Oh, hey. The wedding rehearsal is the night before the wedding. You need to be there. Got it. We'll put it in your phone. I don't have one of those kinds of phones. Oh, I stubbed my toe! Mmm, I stepped on a Lego! Ah! This is Anna and Sophie. Hi. Have either of you two ever been here before? Once. Never. Well, either way, I can't wait to thoroughly disappoint both of you ladies this evening. <laughs> hey, you want to come over with me tonight? Oh, I'm not interested. Oh, come on. No, I'm here with someone. He looks like he'd be your dad. He's not my dad. He's my friend's dad. What? What? I can't hear you. You seem really nice. Oh, I see you. I got you guys. Shows out of town starting middle of January. How'd you do that? I called in a favor. Don't make me regret it. We've never had a super traditional relationship where I depend on you for guidance and stuff. I see. We were kids when we had Claire. When she was a toddler, you moved out and went on and lived your life. Marriage, law school, what's your rush? You're so young. She can be both young and have her shit figured out. <laughs> the Chicago gig you're both doing, there's gonna be a booker there from Montreal. If one of you does well, there's a chance you could be invited to a showcase. One of us? No one needs two unknown comedians from Omaha. Not even Canada. Yeah, so I kind of gave her a little eye contact, played the shy guy role, and just put out a lot of good vibes. You ever go into a place, you sit down, and they go, have you been here before? And then they proceed to tell you how to eat? Are we only here as a favor to Brit, not because you actually think we're good? Well, why the hell else would I book two unknowns from Omaha for a Saturday night show? Ouch. <laughs> you got me, partner. Hello? Hey. Are we... Is this the right place? If I pay you another $20, can you turn it down? 